What's up everybody? Welcome back to another light painting vlog. Jason Reinhardt. Yo. Candace. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> <laughs> We're hiking up to there. Reinhardt, where is it? So this is Peaks of Otter. That's uh, Sharp Top Mountain. 3,875 feet, about a mile and a half uh, hike to the top. So We are about to hike 3,875 feet up there to light paint tonight and we're bringing Candace along so she can model for us. She has no idea what she's about to get nope. into. <laughs> so she's excited to go hiking. We're gonna check back in and see how she feels when we get up there. <laughs> and on another note, so today's forecast is like 97 degrees, uh, heat index of 102. So we're, uh, yeah, we're gonna brave it. And we're braving the heat and the weather and element and yeah. make it to the top. There's a big thunderstorm back there. There's also a rocket launch, supposedly tonight. Yeah, 11 o'clock. So it could be an epic night. We're about to find out. We are officially starting our hike. I have on two bags. Candace has on two bags. Reinhardt has on one bag that probably weighs, what? Yeah, at least 40 pounds. At least 40. And... Notice how I'm in the way back. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm exhausted already. And this is the easy part. Here we go. So everybody knows, Reinhardt has not been moving that quick. He just did that for the B-roll footage. <laughs> I'm not tired. <laughs> Good job. We have made it to the top of Sharp Top Mountain. It is absolutely beautiful up here. We've been doing a bunch of yoga pictures with Candace for her stuff. Now we're gonna figure out what we wanna do for light painting. As Reinhardt said in his really good vlog that you all should check out, we're probably the highest people in Virginia at this point in time, other than people flying through it, obviously. But on ground level, the highest people. And I mean that in the sense of elevation. But we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do, do some light painting tonight, then hike back down and hopefully see a bear. Plan of action. Candace, gonna do yoga poses over there on this rock. Gonna shoot her from here. Neither one of us are gonna fall off of these cliffs. Reinhardt's gonna hit the button because I did not bring a remote. I got you. And we got this insanely epic view. Bada bing. It's almost dark enough to shoot now. We are going to do, or I am going to do, a couple quick portraits. He and this doing yoga poses. The tool that I'm using is the collapsible light sword for light painting brushes. I want to show you guys that you can create these really cool, simple, easy to do portraits using the collapsible light swords. The different shapes that you can create with the light swords are infinite. They're just unlimited shapes you can combine the colors and create all kinds of cool stuff i'm going to show you a couple of those here that we create tonight using the collapsible light swords the other amazing thing about the collapsible light sword is that it can fit in your bag super easy and then it expands out like this to create these really wide bands of light when you're coming up to something like this the top of a freaking mountain it's awesome to be able to throw these in your bag. What I'm really excited about, honestly, the most exciting part, is that Reinhardt is going to go way over there. And we'll show you in a minute. I don't know if you can see it. 
But there's a peak way over there that Reinhardt is going to go spend one of his really cool spirals on. Just an absolutely beautiful night up here at Pizza Otter Sharp, Sharp Top Mountain. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get the light ping now that it's dark enough. Collapsible light swords. Here we go. So we are done shooting with Candace. Thank you very much. She's cold. And but we did get a couple cool shots with her using the collapsible light swords. Again, wanted to show you guys. It's super easy to use those things and you can collapse them down, throw them in your bag, and you can use them with models to create those big wide bands of light and get some really cool shots. Reinhardt's going all the way over there. I gotta climb up those rocks on at the top. Spin a spiral. Spin a spiral over there. It's going to look super cool. You got your frame set up? Uh, yeah. He's All right. got the frame set. All I'm going to do is hit the button for him after he goes over there. We're going to have to set up some kind of signal, maybe like a flash of light to let me know you're ready. Yeah. Like boom, boom or something. All right. We're going to do that. And also, I'm going to go over to the same spot that we just were in with Candace, that rock that has the big, beautiful view. And I'm going to create one of my flowers from the organic series while Reinhardt is going over to his spot. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that now. Reinhardt's all the way over there. Yeah, that first one. Yeah, the first one's good. The first one was the best spiral for sure. Huh. I'm going to take a lantern, go stand on that rock, high ISO, um, 2.8, and just hold a lantern in the sky. So I think it'd be cool if I'm like holding the light. Here he comes. You ready? Rolling. Good. Let's get Candace up there. Oh, that's sketchy, sketchy. If she's clumsy, I wouldn't. Put no, her. okay. Yeah. I mean, cause I gotta. I'm like, I'm like gripping with my toes and my feet, like. <laughs> she's clumsy. <laughs> if she's clumsy, I wouldn't put her up there. Uh-uh, no way. I'm looking out for you. I appreciate that. <laughs> um, let's see. Slow and steady. Yeah. Unfortunately, we're going into the wind. This is definitely not the best scenario for bears. That was a cool shot you got with the lantern. Yeah, I think honestly, the lantern shot I think is the best one of the night. Yeah, I think so. The lantern when you're across, and the lantern up top. Yeah, but no, those were those are great shots.
What'd you do, Reinhardt? My <coughs> a bug. Oh. <coughs> Puke it up, baby. Oh my goodness. That's a big, huge bug. <laughs> <laughs> Was it a moon moth? I don't know what it was. <laughs> it went down my throat and it... Oh man, that sucked. Mm -hmm. Suck some of that water, dude. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Get some water. Uh, Take a cup of broth. I think that wasn't a bee. My legs are I wonder what that's about. <sighs> oh. Centipede Central. Wow. Oh. All right, we're wrapping up this vlog here in Bedford County with Jason Reinhardt. Reinhardt has already gone home. I forgot to wrap up the vlog prior to that, so I'm gonna do it now. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed watching the vlog. We had a really good night up there at uh, the Shark Top Mountain Peaks of Water. It is quite the hike up with the gear on your back. I probably had 35, 40 pounds a gear. Ryan had 40 pounds a gear. Candace didn't carry anything. I did too. <laughs> we got some really cool shots with Candace doing yoga with the collapsible light swords. Uh, something that I really wanted to work on and focus on and show you guys the types of images you can create with those collapsible light swords. You can throw them right in your bag, super easy to travel with, super easy to carry around. And um, Reinhardt got some really cool ones with a lantern, holding the lantern across uh, at the other peak. And he did one of his spiral images, which came out pretty cool. Um, we did a couple other little things just around and uh, did one light painting with Reinhardt sitting up top. I'll show you guys all the images. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the vlog again. If you do, please do give me the thumbs up down below. Questions or comments, put them down in the comment section and I will answer anything that I can. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do hit the subscribe button down below. And until the next video, get out there and get creative.